Let's make it chicken pickles process. Still, it is fine. Hey guys, let's make it chicken pickles. So here we have the chicken. Two uh, kilo, just two kilo of chicken. Let's see. It will be our first time experience. So let's see how it will turn out. Hey, Papa. Hey, Hey, bye. Yeah, the governor. There's one. One per kilo is 260, okay. And this also dough is more than 2 kilo. I'll we'll show you the process of the one. Wow, it's big enough. Right. Oh, Hanako, very nice. Alright. Now we have already started cooking and we'll cook maybe around 10 to 15 minutes I guess. So we'll see you. It's 8.27 p.m. at the moment, it's night time, but let's see the uh, 36 degrees Celsius at the moment. Wow, it's fucking crazy hot, you know? Here is the final result after the cook. So we're gonna tear this chicken into pieces. Let's see. This is one of the hardest part of making dry meat pickles. We have to sit for an hour and we have to tear the meat into pieces under the heat wave and we have to let it dry as well and it takes lots and lot of time and now that i understand why this type of dry meats pickle are very expensive or very pricey now i totally understand i have no complaint after explaining this for the first time it takes a lot of time it spend a lot of time and we have to be patient we have to be patient people you should try out and you understand why these dry meats are very pricey so you will not have to complain it again I also learned something very important that every profession or every work is not easy. Everyone have to put their hard work on it and be patient. Here is the result after one night. I dry under the fan for a night. So yeah, it turned out to be so good. And we, I will start processing. And the item which I'm gonna use is this is garlic, this is ginger, I don't know whether it's too less, I believe it's a little less, that's okay. And I'm gonna put some, uh, this is the king chili, I put 10 piece of king chili. And this is a black pepper, I don't know what do we call it in English. So, um, I'm not a professional but I'm just trying to, uh, just try out for my first time. Let's see whether... Uh, how the test it will turn out whether it will be good or bad but it's my first experiment so now i'm gonna turn on the gas and get ready with some well so i was planning to use 
Maybe I think I'll use this master oil. Master oil. The oil is a little bit less, but I know I can still use this. Uh, what do we call this one in English? Uh, oh, no, no, no. I forgot the name of this oil at the moment. The oil is boiling. The oil, the oil is less, but. I don't know whether I should put more or not, but definitely I know this is not too much, it's a little bit less. The oil is ready now, so I'm gonna put the garlic in the ginger. So the making of pickle is depend on a person in what style do they want to make. So for me I'm not a professional, it's my first trial. So I know it's not that good and it will not be turned up so good like the other the rest of the people. But I hope still then the test will be amazing. And yeah, the preparation of like I said, the preparation of making this pickle is depending on the person, like what style do they want, what style do they cook. So it's um, you know, my style is totally different from the rest of the other. So let's see. I hope the result will turn out good. Yes, here is it. We have to wait for the ginger and garlic to be well cooked and turn out to be like brownies like this. So this is the perfect timing to egg that uh, chicken now. And we, I'm gonna mix it. So I don't think I can ever be show you like when I mix this one because I, I, obviously I need two hands to cook, right? So right now I'm holding my phone, the camera with my left hand and I'm doing with my right hand. So. I'll show you it once it's already done, okay? So here is the final result after the cook. I have done everything. So to be honest, the taste is not as good as like the other rest of the other people who make it sell. But still then, I'm so proud of myself that I can able to make it and yeah, according to me, it's just fine. The taste is not that perfect, but uh, it's still it is fine. I'll tell you one thing, okay? After preparing, done everything, cooking though, like even though if I don't know how to cook, so that's okay. I have to cook it anyway. But the most lazy thing that I do is that, oh my god, I'm so lazy to wash dishes. I don't know whether how other find themselves, but for me, washing this is one of my daily things. Ah, but have to be. No one is there to look after me, to take care. So I have the struggles. I have to do everything by myself.
So yeah, let's now let's put it in a container so that we can eat. We can eat in a month. I'm gonna put it right here in the container so that we can store for a long time. Just keep it inside the fridge. Oops. Yes, amazing. 